Good morning. Happy Monday. Uh, took a break from social media last week. Uh, had some personal things going on, so uh, just took a break. Got to do that sometimes. Um, when I got up this morning, this was my meditation on the swing. I love to come out here uh, in the mornings when the air is kind of crisp and you hear the birds and and the squirrels and, and all the animals. It's nice and quiet. Um, and what came to me was present moment. Uh, as we go through things, uh, it took me back to my meditation um, in Thailand in Chiang Mai. Uh, it's about an hour outside of Chiang Mai, which is my favorite place in Thailand. Um, and one, of the, I stayed in a temple for 21 days, and um, it was a Vipassana retreat. And there was no speaking, no reading, no phones, nothing for 21 days. You just meditate. And you have a guide that you talk to every day so she can walk you through what's going on and so many things went on uh, at that time it made me realize how important cleaning your mind and detoxing your mind is to um, wellness to so being healthy um, it's not only the lower limbs it's your upper as well internal as well as external right internal is the mind so uh, i was having problems and i didn't understand what was going on and sometimes uh during this time it can get really dark and um i went there i went into that place and it was really dark and she told me she says you know you don't you should not focus on the past the past is the past you can't change that um you don't focus totally on the future because the future is your imagination you think you know what your future is and you plan for your future in your mind and according to what you want according to your feelings um, according to expectations um, according to peer pressure um, according to society and what we think we're supposed to do so we make these plans which don't always work out sometimes they do and you know that's what you call a purpose but if they don't you need to be ready or if something happens you need to also be ready to deal with that so you should not totally focus on the future of course we want to be prepared we always want to be prepared but we don't want to totally focus on that future imagination because we do want to be ready for change and we don't want our world to shake too much or have it be uh, just totally overwhelming if these things don't happen because you have something else that you were, you were purposed to do. Uh, she told me, looking at the squirrel over there, so cute, that you stay in the present moment. What's going on with you now? You stay in the present. This is your reality, is your present. Your present is what you can make changes to. You can change your directions. Your presence is what guides you. And I'm like, hmm, that makes sense. Acknowledge the present and keep going. And that's really, really stuck with me. And I really think that was a moment, that was a life-changing moment when she said that. It made a lot of sense to me. 
And so now as I go through things, um, challenges in life, uh, doubts, guilt, all that, I ask myself, where is this coming from? Am I focusing on the past? Guilt, okay. Uh, am I looking too far in the future? Why am I not doing this already? Why am I doing not that already? Why am I here? What what is this? What, what, why 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 what's what's going on? What's happening? This is not the path that I thought I would be on. Okay, sometimes the universe or your higher power has, or whatever you want to call it, something else in mind for you. And what we have to do is be in a position to receive that. And to live it, to be it, it's our purpose. But a lot of people feel they don't know what their purposes are because they don't give their time, their selves, themselves time to sit and take in what the present moment is showing them. Our bodies show us everything. The earth shows us everything. If we listen. We don't listen. Our society is too fast. And we want immediate gratification. And we want things now. We don't want to wait. We don't, you know. But some things are meant for us to have now. Sometimes we have to go through things and do things. Um, to bring us to where we are purposed to be. So anyway, just thinking about that, wanted to share that with you. I'm sitting here with Loki, um, my pup pup. Say hi, Lok Lok. Say hi. <laughs> he joined me this morning for a little while. But anyway, have a good Monday and have a good week. And uh, remember, present moment present moment acknowledge your presence don't stay in the past don't look too far in the future not for too long but acknowledge where you are now cheers <laughs>